So Facebook had to pay big to settle a $550 million lawsuit over its facial recognition software. Bet you didn't even know Facebook had facial recognition software, but they do. And some users in Illinois weren't too happy about it. So they sued. It's not a surprise when you hear about police using facial recognition, but a social media network? Well, believe it or not, you've probably interacted with Facebook's facial recognition software. Think to a time when you uploaded a photo to the platform and then started tagging all of your friends. And Facebook could name your friends before you typed anything in and just tag your friends for you. The photo labeling service is called Tag Suggestions, and it's how the social media network was using facial recognition, basically automating tagging people in photos. And it's what a group of people in Illinois filed a class action lawsuit about. The lawsuit said Facebook violated an Illinois biometric privacy law by scraping facial data from millions of users in their state without any permission, and then using it to suggest tags. The lawsuit also said Facebook failed to notify those users how long that data would be kept. Facebook has said the allegations have no merit. This lawsuit's even possible because of a biometric privacy law that exists in Illinois. Legal experts say similar but less comprehensive laws also exist in Texas and Washington state. And a similar Consumer Protection Act went into effect in California at the beginning of the year. Mark Rottenberg with the Electronic Privacy Information Center told the New York Times, quote, the Illinois law has real teeth. It pretty much stopped Facebook in its tracks. Tech firms and other companies that collect biometric data must be very nervous right now. The law could impact other companies that are using facial recognition or might have plans to. For example, Ring, they filed patents but never implemented facial recognition on their video doorbells. Google Nest video doorbells have facial recognition. Amazon's marketed facial recognition software to police departments. And then don't forget a number of cell phones like Google's Pixel 4 and the Apple iPhone. They use facial recognition to unlock a user's phone. As for Facebook, in the suit, it argued that it should not be allowed to be sued if the members of the class action lawsuit could not show a concrete hardship, something like financial losses. Last year, the social media company asked the Supreme Court to take up this case, but it declined. So Facebook settled. In the agreement, it will have to pay $550 million to eligible users in Illinois. The company disclosed the settlement during a presentation on its quarterly financial results. A Facebook spokesman told the Times, quote, we decided to pursue a settlement as it was in the best interest of our community and our shareholders to move past this matter. Tag suggestions is no longer available on Facebook. But the question remains, do you think companies like Facebook are doing enough to tell consumers how their images are being managed? Let us know in the comments below.